25. Victoria's camp was having an issue with that. Now she came down an hour after at 124.5. Let's see if that has an effect in this fight, Alex. Well, check out the tell the tape. 29, 28 years old for BS Meal, 29 for Alba, 5'7 to 5'6. 125 official weight, 124.5 official weight for VS Mill. 1 and 0, 2, 1 and 0 for VS Mill. Mexico versus Venezuela. All righty. The kickboxer against the wrestler. Can't wait. Let's go up inside the cage with Felipe de Maria. Ladies and gentlemen, here comes the big. Fight of the night! And it's brought to you by La Pelea Estelar de la Noche es traído a ustedes por B Sublime Products, Amistad, Banume, MF Comercial y Clínicas Martínez Wagner. Todos los combates son supervisados por la Comisión Profesional de Artes Marciales Mixtas. All fights are supervised by the Mixed Martial Arts Professional Commission. Comisionada, Commissioner, Sandra Ibet Brígido. Los jueces, the judges, Edgar López, Mayra Arce y Gerardo Morales. La tercera sobre la jaula, the third inside the cage, Daniela Modal. And because there's no better place than here, and no better time than now, here we go. Monterrey, deja que el mundo te escuche. We are live. complex in Monterrey, Mexico, for all the people in attendance and every single MMA fan watching around the planet. Cuando la jaula cierra sus puertas y surge la máxima competencia entre los hombres, it's Luke's time. Five rounds for the Luke's Fight League Fightweight Championship of the World. Cinco asaltos por el título Mosca de Lux by Lee. Presentando primero en la esquina blanca un especialista en striking. Récord profesional de dos ganadas, una perdida. Una altura de un metro con 67 centímetros y un peso oficial de 124.9 libras. Presenting now on the white corner, she's a striker. Professional record of two wins, one loss. She stands 5 feet 6 inches tall and official weight of 124.9 pounds. Fighting straight out of Caracas, Venezuela. She's Daniela Villami. Su oponente al otro lado de la jaula, en la esquina negra. Un especialista en striking. Record profesional de una ganada, cero perdidas. Una altura de un metro con 70 centímetros y un peso oficial de 125 libras. Presenting now on the black corner. She's a striker. Professional record of one win, no losses. She stands five feet seven inches tall. An official weight of 125 pounds. Fighting straight out of Monterrey, Nuevo León, Mexico. She is Victoria Alba. All right, so you all know who the fans are with, where the people's heart is, with the local girl from Monterrey, Nuevo León, Mexico, Victoria Alba. Hostile territory for Daniela Villasmil from Venezuela. This is gonna be interesting. Can't wait. We are ready, everyone's ready. And welcome inside the black and gold cage. The first flyweight queen will be crowned tonight. Alongside UFC veteran Alex Soto, I am Francisco. Oh! David Cajones, Victoria got Daniela. Daniela Villas been in trouble for her first time in her career. And she's able to get out, but she looks rocked. Oh man, she got clipped. Unbelievable. Ah, oh, that was gonna be it right there. Beautiful counter there. And look at that counter wrestling from Alba. Yeah, Villas been in trouble for the first time. 
And not only that, look at I love that framework. She's just pushing that forearm right across her face. Man, but the tenacity of Yasmil. Yeah, and that's trying to power, obviously, trying to clinch her opponent, push her against the cage. Yeah, beautiful. There you go. She's breaking oh, apart. Oh, big knee right there. And the kickboxing is working so far. Yeah, she's doing a great job of trying to frame up and keeping her hips away. It's really difficult. She's got, there it is now. She's broken up that arm. But it's when she, it's with BS Mills able to wrap both arms around. Now it is, that's going to be a problem here. Because he's going to drop yep. on that single leg. Yeah, what well, we saw from Danielle in the first two fights, a lot of dirty boxing, clinch, Olympic wrestling type of fighting. But so far, Victoria has been able to neutralize all of it. Yeah, she's got to push that head away. Not going to go for that 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 um, that guillotine choke there. She's got to cross face that that head, get her off her center line. And Victoria's power is obvious. Nice Although Villas Mili is able to get a takedown, this is going to be very interesting. Yeah. Villas Mili is able to get a position to start working. Yeah, Villas Mili is just power. Look at that. There's no stopping her. Yeah, very valuable moments here for Daniela Villasmil to recover, Alex. Man, there it is. There she is. She's doing a fantastic job. Alba's pushing away, making it really difficult for Villasmil to, to settle. That's really what, the, what Villasmil's trying to do right now, is just settle on that takedown, but hasn't been able to really get comfortable yet. Yeah, trying to get into side control is Daniela Villasmil. Although Alba, with an open guard right now, maybe trying to hip out to her right. Potential sweep here with all that pressure. Yeah. She's set up right now. So Villasmil was able to weigh in at 124.5 after almost missing weight and wasting a big chance to fight for the title. She's but now she recovered <laughs> a few pounds ah. for this fight. Now she's got to turn the other way. There it is. Excellent. Good movement on that. Right, so after early success for Victoria Alba, Daniela Villasmil is trying to control the fight. Watch out for those up kicks right there. That takes a lot of energy now. She needs to turn her body towards Villasmil. Boy, this is really comfortable there. She needs to get her shoulders up against the fence. Try yeah. to use the fence. This is a very good position for Villasmil. Let's see if she starts working the elbows and the knees. Alba looking to get out. Man, it's been a crazy turn of events so far. There it is. Now she needs to get on her knees and get up, get her back up against the fence. But now Villasmil is in a great position now to do some ground and pound. Yep. She has been a bit cautious, working more for the position than for damage. Daniela Villasmil trying to get that leg out. Maybe work into a mount. Now, although V.S. Mill has been working on this, she hasn't done a lot of damage. Well, let's see what could happen in the last 60 seconds of this first round. She definitely doesn't want to get hit again. That's for, that's for sure. There we go. There are some punches there that are finding their mark. All right. With what we've seen, who would you give the advantage in the first round, Alex? Yeah, well, so far now, V.S. Mill is the one that's aggressing. Oh, nice up kick. Man, those are dangerous. We go back to that Gekar Musasi Jacare fight. An up kick and knock you out cold. And Victoria Iba is able to get out of trouble. Now working on the clinch. And that's been very difficult for Alba to do, you know, throughout this first round. We'll see how the judges score that first round, but nice movement there. Now getting that underhook. She's got to get the double. Oh, she stand right up. Oh, trying to go for the snap now. Okay, oh. not the first round. I was expecting to be very honest <laughs> with you, but you know, let's see what the judges go for. Is it the knockdown, which is obviously very valuable? Yeah. Is it ground control? You know, in this case, you know, let's take a look at that replay. Here's that counter. Oh, just caught her double. Really caught her off balance, and man, it looks like Alba almost had the fight finish. 
You know, it just depends what the judges are going to call this one, right? Are they going to, you know, see how, you know, how close Alba was trying to finish that fight? Yeah. Or is it going to be, you know, the wrestling that VS Mill pull, pulled out? You know, yeah. it, it was a lot of pressure that she put on, but not a lot of damage. And really, you know, the one who was exerting a lot of the pressure and a lot of the energy was VS Mill. Yeah. Trying to really settle in that takedown. Wasn't able to until much, much later in the round. Yeah, that's why I love about working with a UFC veteran like <laughs> my buddy here, my compa, Alex Hunter. Great analysis is always my friend. This is this is what's so fun about this game. You know, just watching this and, and then seeing these these fighters go through these crazy obstacles. All righty. So the kickboxing champion, Victoria Alba, trying to keep things going against Venezuelan wrestler Daniela Villasmil. Good exchange right there. The combination, Villasmil going for it. Going all or nothing there. Quick combination for Villasmil. Oh. She's coming into her own. That's the Daniela Villasmil we knew for the first two fights. Very desperate on those, uh, those attacks. Wow. Let's see if Alba's able to escape here. Again with those forearms. Pushing back on that head. VSML doesn't want anything to do with the stand-up. Yeah, exactly. Even though she did, you know, she just landed a good one against Alba. This is gonna be a five-rounder. We gotta good keep knee. that in mind too. I don't know if Alba can can I mean excuse me, I don't know if VS Mill can do this for five rounds. It takes so much power to just try to get your opponent down. All right, going for the single leg. VS Mill 2-0. Inside the black and gold cage, two on one overall. 28 years old. A lot of experience though. She's been doing Kung Fu since she was a little girl. Alba right now is, needs, to, needs to separate those arms. That's what she should be working on right now. Separate that grip. Be heavy, heavy, heavy. There it is, now the grip is separated. There it is, beautiful. All righty. Oh, Victoria Alba oh. got her good. And VS Mill's arms are heavy. They're heavy now, trying to really hold on for that takedown. She's moving slow, taking deep breaths. <laughs> and she caught her again. Short hook, and VS Mill always with a lot of power going for the home run punches. Gets a more calculated short attacks from Alba. She's been more effective so far. Yeah, Alba's just the better striker. Whoa. As soon as I say that, of course, VS Mill lands a, a stiff left hand. Yeah, but Daniela has been more power, more heart, more guts. Alba, more effective, tighter stand-up game. Yep, and defending against that takedown just in, the entire time. Nice knee to the body there. Yeah, and we're in close action here. It's right by our broadcast position as we see VS Mill landing a knee. Good. Alba able to switch things around. Yeah, Alba turned that one around. She turned the corner off the cage. Mm. Nice counter block. And then a beautiful right hand. Turn, turn, turn. Now she went straight back and now she's up against the cage. Now she's turning. There it is. Beautiful. Wow, that was VS Mill's game. And if Alba is able to neutralize it, the Venezuelan contender is going to be in a lot of trouble. Again, now be, just Via Smil is just so powerful. She's very strong. You know, we see how she struggled to make weight, but now this is a lot of time left in the second round. And this is a five round championship bout. Oh. Alba just missing with that overhand right, trying to survive the attack of Via Smil. She's looking more comfortable on her feet. Definitely, I mean, Via Smil's taking some deep breaths. Wow, good left there. Yeah, but she is connecting as, as well. There we go. Yeah, and Villasmil's trying to get more comfortable now here in the second round. Alba just took a deep breath as well. Oh! oh. Short hook right there from Victoria <laughs> Alba. <laughs> oh, Villasmil got her good. Yeah, she did. She beautiful block. It's Beautiful block with the two, and then comes right back with the two. It's Alba's turn. Oh! Push kick. Oh! Down once again. 
She looks to be in trouble. And Alba now trying to take advantage. Oh! His feet is rocked. That was this an illegal knee. Here. Oh! Wait, the referee's very close. Yeah, she's watching it. Via Smil's still moving. She's still moving. All right, she comes back up. Wow, with the double unders as well. She does have a lot of heart. Victoria Alba with a great reaction here. Willing to do anything to win this second round. Wow, just the pressure of Via Smil is it's just exhausting. All righty, so once again, my friend, do you go for octagon control or do you go <laughs> for damage? Man, because that's, that's exactly one. the same thing as on round one. Man, Via Smil is, is barely standing right now. She's exhausted. I don't, I don't know if she can be, should be able to hold this kind of pace for the five rounds. Well, Alba has been very close to finish the fight off in <laughs> rounds one and two. Yes, So absolutely. I don't know. Man. Just back and forth. This fight is as is, is, is exciting as I thought it was going to be. So the referee got very close. She's talking to Daniela right now as we see some of the best moments. I am intrigued about what the referee is talking to her corner about. Well, the corner kind of, is telling her, usually referees go to the corners and say, hey, make sure your fighter is, is I'm not going to let your fighter sit there and eat more punches like this. If I see that again, I'm going to stop the fight. Okay. All right. You know, one of the things that referees do when they see a fighter get, you know, really injured in the in the round, they keep their eyes on them the entire time while they're while the corner's talking to them. They're looking for things like, hey, is the is the corner freaking out because the corner's not used to seeing this? You know, they're they're looking at the fighter. Is the fighter okay? Man, respect. Hashtag respect Absolutely. to these two Guerreras. They're giving it all. 100% man who wants it more that's the question tonight I gotta say I was expecting a battle this is much better oh. than what I expected oh Especially now from Victoria Alba Alba's teeing Good off change. now Villas Mil is in trouble push this, kick this could be it this could be it yeah Villas Mil very smartly going oh, to the clinch oh me and Victoria using her Muay Thai big punch right oh. there Villas Mil barely defending herself big body shot right there Another front kick. Oh, and there's the Muay Thai right there. And the referee's very close. Yasmil going for that desperate attempt off a takedown. And Victoria, oh, very composed, sprawl. knows she has the fight right now. Wow, Yasmil is able to survive. Again, back to breaking that arm. Break, break, break that grip. That's what she's got to do. Alba's got to break that grip. And Start fighting for hand position here. Yeah, there's that Muay Thai background. Knee after knee, going right to the body, taking everything from Daniela. Oh, man, trying to get that, that framing up against the face of V.S. Mil, but it's, it's going to be very difficult. I mean, she's on her like glue. There's a double under. Now she's breaking free. Alba could let go here and push away. See if she's able to do this. Knee attempt from B.S. Mil, but a stronger one from Alba. Wow, <laughs> Alba just Frankenstein walking her. Yeah. Another shot, right cross. B.S. Mil trying her best, but he's leaving a freeway there in the middle. Oh, back and forth. Yeah, very open. She's just looking for that home run punch. Man, both of these girls are exhausted. There we go. Now she's got her back. Alba's got her back now. Let's see if she takes it to a takedown. It'll be very interesting to see. But it's the Muay Thai once again. The knee, oh. elbow attempt. And we're halfway into oh, the beautiful third round body head combination. and halfway into the fight. There it is again, teeing off again. Yeah, we just really surviving somehow right next to our broadcast position. We can see how Villasmil is trying to oh. desperately survive, but she looks so tired. Those sprawls are awesome for Alba. 
Yeah, those body shots are taking everything from Villasmil. Man. How does Villasmil have right any energy still? Yeah. Nice push kick there from Alba. Right hand connects. Counter right again. Pressure. Alba going to the head. Another front kick. A minute and a half left, and the crowd's going nuts. Oh. Villasmil going down again. She's got to try to stick to that takedown. Man, the crowd is going crazy watching this fight. And there it is. Beautiful, yeah. beautiful sprawl there from Alba. And once again, the referee very close. Man, Alba just falls. Yeah, Villasmil able to survive it for how long? That's a question. There's it is. Oh, oh, oh. Alba with the big right. Another push kick right there. These both of these girls are exhausted, Francisco. Right yeah. hand, left hand. Alba being the aggressor right now, looking better. She got her again twice. And Villasmil with a takedown attempt. That's taking everything she has right now. Last 30 seconds of the middle round here. Third round, here we go. 20 seconds left. There it is, big. 10 seconds. Oh, right hand. We are going into the championship rounds. I don't know how long will this take. I don't even know how we got here, but here we are. <laughs> round number four and five coming out next oh my on UFC goodness. Fight Pass. This has been so much fun. Let's take a look at some of the replays that we've had so far. There's Alba just connecting. I mean, when Alba gets a rhythm, you know, it, it, it almost seems like she can handle the fight right there and just finish it. There's that beautiful knee to the body. Bias Mill just can't, just can't handle the pressure. It's just so much. You know, a lot of this could be done. You know, she, she had trouble making the weight. You know, this is, has been a five round fight, but Alba is just fire tonight. Beautiful left hooks. Straight left, and then here's that lightning fast right hand down the middle. Boom, connecting. Alrighty, for the first time in these two ladies' careers. Wow, she's wobbly too, Francisco. Yeah. They she, are going to the championship rounds. Man, her lips is swollen. Oh man, she can barely stand right yeah. now. Yeah, this is gonna be a very interesting call for the referee in case she gets in trouble again. Victoria Alba looking stronger, more composed. The sharper striker. Oh, nice. She gets nice. her again. And Villasmil, that's going to be her call. That's going to be her signature. Trying to go for the oh, takedown. Beautiful right hand. Oh, this could be it. That's it. That's, that's it. it. Wow. 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 All right. Ladies and gentlemen, meet Queen Victoria. By knockout. People are freaking out here, man. She earned it. Yeah. Alba earned it. Ew, that's, uh, that was a beautiful, beautiful display there, man, of heart and just getting after it, man. Wow. That was an epic finish. One of the biggest, biggest finishes we've seen in Locks Five. Like, this was awesome, man. And, you know, I. I gotta say, it's not that I underestimated Victoria, but the way Daniela Villasmil had looked, she got steamrolled <laughs> over both of her opponents. Yeah. And her physique, her body, the way she looked, how focused she was, I thought this was not a, be the outcome. Yeah. But Victoria oh, Alvin just came and proved me wrong, and, and props to her. And when I was talking to her yesterday during our YouTube show, she was just so confident. She was telling me how hard it was for her to adapt 
can go from kickboxing and Muay Thai to MMA, but the work she has done, her Jeez. corner, I gotta give him props, man. Mad props. She, this girl could be a star. Yeah. Let's, let's take a look at that replay. So here we, here we are. Here we are at the uh, in the fourth round. There's that big right hand. It, I mean, she was very wobbly when she came out into the fourth round. And there's Alba with the push kick. And here's the right hand. Beautiful setup here. Another that, she was very successful with that push kick, but here it is on the straight right, down the pipe. And she just went down, she collapsed. The referee had seen enough. Danny Murad said she's seen enough. That was it. It was incredible. Yeah, this is one of the best performances, male or female, that we have seen in Lux Fight League. Yeah. She was impressive. <laughs> An unbelievable finish. Props to these two Guerreras. They battle or did the end. Let's go up inside the cage with Felipe de Maria. Señoras y señores, la referee Daniela Modat ha detenido el combate a los 36 segundos del cuarto asalto. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee stopped the fight at 36 seconds of the fourth round to declare the winner by knockout. And 